Switzerland is a bit of a mystery to most people in Europe, and maybe even around the world. But one thing is for sure, the Swiss, and Switzerland is famous for quite a few things. In this video, I want to take a look at the obvious ones, which maybe most of you know, and some of the less obvious ones which are worth a look. So, let's jump into the video. Luna, do you like chocolates? Yes, I love chocolates. In fact, many foodstuffs involving chocolate exist, particularly desserts, including cakes, pudding, mousse, chocolate brownies, and chocolate chip cookies. Yeah, everyone love chocolates. Then you have to know this, Switzerland is famous for its chocolate. Whether you eat Linda chocolate in your country, or just know Switzerland's fame for chocolate production, there is no going past it. Switzerland is one of the most famous producers of chocolate in the world. Although to be fair, within Europe there is one other, that is Belgium, although you will never hear a Swiss admit that there is an alternative to Swiss chocolate. From supermarket level with free, Lindet, Callier and even local brands, to famous chocolatiers like Latterich and Stedeler Switzerland has it all. And the next thing that is famous in Switzerland. What else can you make with milk besides amazing chocolate, yeah? Cheese, most of you will have seen or had a type of Swiss cheese at home but you are certainly not prepared for the variety and quality of cheeses you can get in Switzerland. If you love cheese, aside from maybe France, this is one of the best places to eat. And on top of the cheese, which you can generally just grab in the supermarket, the Swiss have also put it to good use with raclette, squares of cheese you melt and eat with potatoes, and fondue, a pot of melted, alcohol-filled cheese you eat with bread. Next thing about Switzerland is Swiss banking secrecy has been something we have all know about from spy films since we were kids. And it has become even more famous in the last few years because of complaints about tax evasion from the EU and the USA. If you happen to walk down the Bonifstrasse in Zurich and look at some of the name plates on the doors, you will see just how many lucrative, small and semi-secret banks there are. And to top that off, it is rumored that there are vaults filled with Nazi gold under the street. The banking industry is not what it used to be though. The laws protecting secrecy and tax evasion have changed a lot lately, meaning lots of people have pulled their money out of Switzerland. And the big banks here are far below their lofty heights of pre-2009. And one of the most famous thing in Switzerland that most of them might not know. With the Apple Watch becoming trendy and the Fitbit on everyone's wrists, Swiss watches are not as popular as they once were. But Swiss watches are still leaving this country by the bucket load. Every tourist wants to take home some chocolate, and if they can afford it, a watch too. Wouldn't you love to own a Rolex? There are so many watch brands in Switzerland. Most you will know, some you will be surprised are Swiss. Most of the famous brands are Swiss, and many are owned by Swatch. Here are a few of them like Rolex, Cartier, Omega, Longines, Tisset, Tag Heuer and Swatch. And a final surprising fact, most of the watches in Switzerland are made in a very small area, in the French-speaking part of the country, often in very small towns. For most of you hearing this might seem insane. For over a decade some people lived here without a car. The public transport system and the trains in particular are amazing in Switzerland. Going almost everywhere, within minutes. And most of the time, you can just sit and stare at the stunning scenery. Getting the trains to travel from one end and height of the country to another is no easy task. Let me tell you. But the Swiss have managed to produce and maintain this marvel for over a century. You can even take a train nearly 45 degrees straight up mountains. What more can you ask for? If you are here on a vacation, seriously think about taking a train ride in the Alps. The Glacier Express from St. Moritz, or even Chur, to Zermatt is one of the most popular and spectacular. Especially in winter. The scenery is amazing. Of course, once you get over the food, the watches and the transport, what else do you think of? Yeah, mountains. Being smack bang in the center of the Alps Switzerland is approximately 60% mountains. So, if you love great scenery, the outdoors or outdoor sports, this is the place to come. There are some amazing mountains in Switzerland including the Matterhorn, 
Jungfrau and the Iger, both you may have heard of. But there are so many more. So whether you come to ski, to hike, or just take a gondola up to see the view. Switzerland has it all. One of the most appreciable thing in Switzerland is quality and reliability. These might seem like things, but they cover many different aspects of Swiss life, culture and products. In fact, the reliability of Swiss products like watches, clocks and knives is so famous, they even have a standard for it. It also affects the punctuality of the Swiss trains, which is often insanely astounding. To the minute. And it also shapes the way many businesses run and thrive in the country. Ask anyone you know where is the best place in the world to buy something super reliable, and Switzerland will be one of the top answers. And the next astounding thing about Switzerland is its direct democracy. Switzerland has implemented more or less the original Greek democracy which is now actually known as direct democracy. California also has this to some extent, but the Swiss have implemented it nationwide. Swiss citizens actually vote four times a year on various issues that are usually suggested by the people themselves. By collecting enough signatures, 100,000 to be exact, the parliament can consider and then put to the vote changes that the people suggest. Try that in most countries, and it just ain't gonna work. Switzerland is really one of a kind country in the world. It has achieved so much during the last century that it is even hard to count how much they have, from the best cheese to the best clocks, from being one of the most popular tourist destinations to a leader in science and technology. It is one of the safest, nicest, cleanest, wonderful places to visit in the world. If you ever plan for a world tour then don't forget to add Switzerland in your list.